in step, strike. Hi guys, uh, Tuesday, as I said today, it was gonna be um, quite busy uh, running around, getting the th things um, sorted out for the rest of the week. Uh, also had a school session today um, with a um, school football team. Uh, now, just on the way to the Enfield, um, have a one-to-one -one session, five till six, um, and then the normal Enfield Development Centre session, six till seven. So looking forward to a great evening. Um, as I said, um, this week we we'll work on decision-making um and gonna try and put a few clips up and talk through a few coaching points uh in regards to that um topic this evening in the video so um yeah hope you enjoy the video another day um looking forward to tonight and i'll catch up with you later in the day go a strike Well done, last one. Go. Ah, oh. strike. Just arrived home. Um, had a great one-to-one -one session. Didn't actually catch as much footage as I was hoping to, um, as my phone was actually running out of battery. Um, but got a few clips that I'm going to um, put into the video. Um, also a good session at the Enfield um, Development Centre. Um, so a great evening. Uh, really, really looking forward to tomorrow. Big day. Um, and just going to go inside now. I'm going to take you through uh, a couple of the players um, and some details on them because there's some great stories uh, and I'm really looking forward to seeing if we can uh, complete uh, a sign-in within the first kind of part of this challenge so yeah looking forward to it I'm gonna go inside now get some dinner and um, we'll go through some players and some ideas for how it's gonna go tomorrow so we've got the under 10 fixture against Barnet. Uh, just had the confirmed details through today. We're playing 7v7 uh, for 20 minute quarters uh, on the AstroTurf at the first team training ground, which is also the first team stadium, the Hive. Um, so really looking forward to that. Um, we've got a squad of eight players. Um, and there's just a couple of players I wanted to touch on their stories, um, kind of in regards to performance um, and um, myself and stuff like that. Um, <clears throat> for example, there's one of the boys who myself, I've coached. I first coached him in kind of a TOTS program years and years ago before I went to university. So he would have only been three or four years old. Um, I was only about 16, 17, um, and kind of the first things I got into coaching, and I've seen him go through different programs into performance over the last two or three years, uh, and really flourish and really go forward. Um, so players like that, I'm just so excited to try and take them the full circle from first kicking a ball all the way through um, to to hopefully signing for a for a pro club. Um, you've got another player who came on a free talent ID event. 
I think about a year and a half ago in the summer. Um, so it was a free event, anyone could sign up online. He came down, um, done really well, came into our one of our development centres. From there, went into our county centre, continued to do well, uh, made the step into the elite, uh, has played a couple of matches for us, um, and now hopefully this is an opportunity for him to showcase himself in front of a pro club. Um, you've got another player who I have been coaching since he first joined Proformance. He's always been in my groups, uh, in Ivar and then in Slough. Um, and also I've done quite a few one-to-one -one sessions with him, uh, technical work. So really excited to see if those small technical things that we've worked on in personal sessions um, can help him in the game and hopefully help him get signed. Um, <clears throat> as well as that, we have, trying to think, um, a couple of players who've been recommended to us um, through other contacts who have been in trials at other clubs, haven't quite made it, but hopefully this will be a good level for them. Um, and a couple of other players just from our programme. But it's really exciting to see um, the opportunities that we're giving these young children, these players, and hopefully all the hard work that us, ourselves, the parents, the players have put in over the years are going to come to fruition. And tomorrow, really excited to hopefully get some signings. Um, so yeah, going to be building up to the game tomorrow, wash the kits tonight. Um, and yeah, really looking forward to tomorrow. So hopefully tomorrow is going to be a great video and uh, looking forward to the rest of the week. So I hope you're enjoying this, guys, and uh, we'll catch up with you soon.